Once you're ready to steal somebody else's husband, yours, <laughs> yours, <laughs> sweetie me again, sweetie me again. Record that. Um, then also, who else do we have? Um, there's a new girl named Ange An Angela, Angela Oakley. Um, now, I don't know Angela, but I hear her husband is everything. I hear her husband is everything. I hear her husband is everything. And y'all can even say he's too old for her because Portia is in the midst of divorcing her grandfather. So, nah. Okay, this is a, the perfect age range for Portia right here. I just feel like, you know, even though you may not be married, it's just some things are just common sense of how to behave around a married couple. Mm -hmm. And for me, I don't even like to stand and look someone's husband eye to eye and carry on more than a three-minute conversation. Mm -hmm. So when she, we go to exchange telephone numbers, like I was telling somebody the other day, every type of communication that you have with this couple needs to go through the wife. Like, and you should know that at some point in your life. And if you overstep that boundary, then your intentions were wrong from the beginning. Portia wrote a coloring book about wanting to be R. Kelly's main girl, despite him having a wife, leaving a woman that was screaming to be let out of R. Kelly's sex cult. She fantasized about her ex-husband being her man when he was in a public relationship with his baby mother. Then she's engaged to a dude who's soon to be ex-wife was her co-worker. She met both of them on the show at the same time and started an affair with him. So yeah, journalists are going to ask basic questions and not stroke your ego. Damn. Mm -mm, mm -mm, I'm sorry. I work for Dish Nation. I am in the world of journalism. So my uh, word needs to be... Journalism is... <laughs> <laughs> so you're, you're downplaying my job? This word right here is killing me. What's this? Reciprocation? Reciprocation? Let me see, Portia. It's a big, it's, it's, Reprocity? It's Reprocity. Well, no, uh-uh, no. Nope, nope. Look at it. Come look at it. Come look at it. Hold on. Give me a minute. <laughs> Reciprocity. To gain so Reciprocity. Heart mess, child. I would like Portia to spell scepter. So. <laughs> it's almost hurtful to me to watch her be so dumb. Somebody wrote a death on 265 days a year. What is wrong with that? <laughs> Portia Williams coming back to Real Housewives of Atlanta? That's false. But Portia Gavadia is in the building. <laughs> See y'all. Well, I guess Portia Williams is coming back to the Real Housewives of Atlanta because but Portia Gavadia filed for divorce, child. And we don't even know if that's truly her real name because you all know I've been reporting about it that the man re-entered this country after being deported due to his criminal past under a fake name and fake identity. Got his paperwork on that fake identity and then decided to file for a citizenship in this country on that fake identity. And that's how he was caught. For those of you who missed that video, I have linked that video in the description below. If you want more information on Portia filing for divorce, I have linked that video in the description below. Now let's get into the current topic. What's up my Vina loves? It's Miss Vina D coming to you all from Vina Timmer News. Well, after all of the recent back and forth between Portia and Simon, for those of you who missed those videos, just go to the RHOA playlist on this channel to get caught up on all of the back and forth and hot mess that is Portia and Simon divorce. Okay, Simon is now apologizing to his family. My life is not a storyline my life is a story of perseverance oh and allergies yeah it's dry where i am it's kicking my butt so please 
hanging there with my voice. I'm doing my best to still get content out, even though I'm going through it right now. The Quadia family has always been a prideful family, probably one of the largest families in Nigeria. Our name is literally tied to one single family, meaning most people with the last name Obadia are related. So when one of their family member is reduced to a storyline, thousands of family members are also affected by the narrative created and meant to destroy. I want to publicly acknowledge and apologize to my family, the Obadias, for the pain my poor judgment may have caused and brought upon our family name. I'm so sorry. I beg for your forgiveness. He wanted that fame so bad. How about you tell them personally this person meant? It will seem more sincere and from the heart. He responded, fortunately, they are spread around the world being productive and not around the corner. Great idea, though. Morris teeth with her immorality not about to pull a wig with this one nope and that's on miss diane not miss diane her mama and right when people were like oh thank you today wasn't too bad the back and forth and all of that as if they can't delete unfollow block mute there are so many options on social media do not see what other people are posting but majority of the people complaining, and they like the mess. But when Simon posted these images talking about he was approached to start a podcast, uh, they were like, oh, no, absolutely not. Just please. Every topic shouldn't be about her. I don't think so. But anyways, there's more mess going on with Simon and Portia. But I figured this is a quick short simple and perfect way to close out this week's episode <laughs> as it relates to a Porsche and simon hot mess of a divorce okay hopefully simon learned his lesson and i do wish that both of them the best because my goodness it's been a lot and there's a lot more to come and I hope that Portia is also learning her lessons too. I'm wishing all of you well and take care. Thank you all for your love and support. If you're not subscribed to the channel, go ahead and subscribe to the channel. Go ahead and leave this video a thumbs up. Also, turn on notifications so when I do post, you're aware that I posted. And I will see you all in the comment section. Remember to always have the God bless attitude, which is being positive at all times and seeing the good in every situation. Have a great day, guys. God bless. <laughs>